don't stay in, in their flight path, you won't start having a problem. So when you approach a hive, you always you smoke it first, then always work from behind. You don't want to get in the bees' flight path. Yeah. You get in their flight path, and they're gonna start. The guard bees are gonna start bouncing. The next thing you want to never wear dark clothes or black. <laughs> like I am. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I think you're a bear. Yeah, exactly. You may look like a bear. I, I do. It's beard. Uh, you know what I mean? I can't reason with these bees either. They're honey, not likely to listen honey, to reason. Honey bees, the only, they won't harm you at all unless you're, they're, they feel threatened. Or you're wearing brown. Yeah. yeah. Skunks and bears are... What this is on the ground is, is the comb honey from the fire. Mm-hmm. What I'm doing, it, it, it smelled like smoke right after the fire. You couldn't. It still smells a little smoky. Uh -huh. We took the comb honey, and uh, what we're doing is recycling it back into the beehive. Okay. The bees, bees are coming out, and they're they're uh, they're feeding off of it. Oh, they're getting the honey out of the cells, and they're recycling it. So nothing's gonna ever gonna get wasted. Okay. All our stuff in the honey house never gets wasted. All the wax, everything gets recycled. Excellent. So, you'd say it's a sustainable practice then? This is a spring time of the year. There isn't any flowers blooming, so the bees are hungry. They're looking for food. Other than what they have in their stores, the reason this hive is so high is because I didn't get a chance to take off the fall honey. <clears throat> because of my health, because of the accident, I didn't get a chance to take the fall honey off, but it's there for the spring, so if they have a long, cold spring and the flowers don't bloom, then they have stores to eat off of. Once it warms up, we'll take it off and extract it. Hmm. See, these bees aren't, even though they're on the comb, they don't feel threatened because there's a food source here for, for them, and uh, all they are is hungry. So they want to, it has, you can see the straw like thing coming out of their mouth. It's actually like a, it is a straw, and it's sucking the nectar back out of the uh, comb for them to go back and re deposit it back into the. So, I would open the hive up on a nice day, but this isn't a nice day. Um, but this is the first step in the process. Yes, this is the first step. It's the bees. Mm -hmm. Without the bees, you won't have anything. Okay. Um, Governor Rendell once said that uh, Pennsylvania honeybees is uh, Pennsylvania's tiniest livestock, which right. it is. So, <laughs> it is. Yeah. This hive here, unfortunately, the part of the colony collapse. There's not a bee in it. There's mm. plenty of honey here. Yeah, right. I need a hive tool, which I didn't bring with me. Can you explain colony collapse disorder a little colony bit? Colony collapse disorder started a couple years ago, and it run. But whatever the phenomenon is, the bees just simply disappear from the hive. And uh, they just fly away and never come back. And uh, there's a lot of people look, researching it, trying to find out what's going on. Uh, some people have theories like cell phone use, um, microwave. I mean, bees are disoriented when they leave. Wireless frequency. Yeah. Um, to just to the fact that they're unhealthy. Bees are unhealthy anymore because of the, the way farming is done these years. Hmm. Like not planting the cover crops. What about pesticide and herbicide? Yeah, that's that's a big killer. Uh, they, the Chinese bring a lot of seed into America mm -hmm. that has a insecticide already in this incorporated in the seed. So when the when the when the blossom the, pl the plant flowers, mm -hmm. the harmful insects that would do harm to the plant, but they never thought about the beneficial insects. So therefore, honeybees are out pollinating and they're picking up this insecticide and, and dying off. Mm -hmm. You said there is a lot of research going on yes, to address uh, that. Yes, a lot of the universities around the world are looking into it. They're researching it big time. Mm -hmm. you know, Penn State's doing a lot. Iowa is doing a lot. And Ohio State. A lot of the state universities are really looking for the looking for cause why the honeybees are disappearing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hopefully. I mean, it, it brought national attention, you know. Uh, Larry King Live, uh, a lot of the TV, CNN, they were going out and interviewed beekeepers and mm -hmm. try to figure out, because this, this is definitely going to affect the nation's food supply. Mm -hmm. you know, it's a serious I, thing. I tell the kids in school, I said, uh, 
you have an apple tree with a, with with pollination you get five apples um, without pollination you may get one or two mm -hmm. and they're not going to be very big like big juicy apples one of the uh, it, it affects the larger visual. food yeah chain everything yeah there's there's ever a lot of varieties of fruits and vegetables without pollination like almonds mm -hmm. without honeybee pollination you're not going to have a seed or a nut almonds they really count and they really that's where you, they pay a lot mm -hmm. to have bees trucked in from other states Pennsylvania sends a lot of bees to California to yeah. for almonds they're a crucial part of the ecosystem mm -hmm. and so you'd say that's step one and what yes. will step two be so. well without the bees and step two is giving the bees a home okay building the equipment Okay. And we can show, show you that inside. Okay. So, and naturally, honeybees find the tree or inside wall of a home. Okay. But, uh, you got to build a man-made home for them. Okay. Well, when you're doing the process, do you remove something from here and then and then just carry it down? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, well, we take the honey off. Wait, what's the, the, the sheet called? Hmm? What's the, the sheet called that you take down? Is that called a super? Super, yes. Super. Yes. Uh, well, I'll show you here. 